Hello, I'm Graham Fitch and I'm a pianist and teacher of piano and I'm bringing you this series of videos on the Casio Grand Hybrid from my piano studio in Wimbledon. I have in front of me a Casio Grand Hybrid that has features on it that I think set it apart from other pianos of its type. Um, the collaboration with Bechstein we find here developed in collaboration with Bechstein, a nice pluck on the end of the piano here. We also get keys, wooden keys, which I think is very unusual in a digital instrument of this type, um, that, that you can see here, I don't know if you can see close up here, there's wooden keys and inside there's a proper moving hammer action. So it actually feels like a grand piano under the touch, which is great if you're used to um, playing grand pianos. The other feature that I think really, really interests me um, right down here, I've got three settings. I can decide to have a Berlin Grand. That's my Bechstein. Now, a Bechstein has, and I'll demonstrate them in a minute. Bechstein has traditionally um, been thought of as a very warm sounding piano. It's got a kind of velvetness to it. Um, we have next to it something called the Hamburg Grand. Now, I'll leave that to you to, to guess uh, what type of piano that is but it sounds rather brighter. It's got a, a kind of brilliance in, in the overtones that make it very suitable for large concert halls. Now, the next button you'll see is the Vienna Grand. Now, the Viennese piano traditionally um, has a really clear sound. You'll hear every single um, nuance come through, but with great clarity and transparency. So, you know, if you're preparing for a recital somewhere or exam, and you just want to get as many different uh, types of, of piano uh, experience, then here you have it. And you can change the touch weight and various other things that you can do um, in the controls there to, to make the piano sound and feel rather different each time. What I'm gonna do is demonstrate each one of them. Starting off with the Berlin Grand, and I'm going to take a little snippet uh, of a Chopin Nocturne so you can hear it on each of the three settings. And now to the Hamburg. And finally to the Vienna. I don't know if you could pick up on the differences. I could certainly feel and hear them 